This has become one of my favorite videos to do on the channel. Ciao. Roll the tape. To start, I will section the bank's area. Concentrate the hair and twist it on the center of the chin and cut it with a razor blade. To accentuate the curtain bangs style, comb the hair to the opposite side and cut a diagonal back. Observe the effects on the bangs. This look is very popular right now for men's and women's. To cut the perimeter on the back area, I will use the freeform technique. Here you can see the sections that I did to separate the interior of the layers from the exterior and the long sides. Follow me on Instagram, there I post every week the results of the next video one week before. Using the condensed technique with the twin combs, I will cut the graduation following the angle that you see in the picture of the iPad. Connect the length of the bangs with the weight line that we create on the layers. Cut in a horizontal line from the front to the back. To reproduce the color, I will use this green color as a base. I will add this blue to the formula to create this dark green with a hint of blue. This color will provide a green tonality to the dark color of this hair on a natural way. If you like more videos like this in YouTube, help this video by subscribing to the channel, giving it a like and click the bell so you can get notifications in the future. Thank you to all of you for your support. We are on our way to the 50,000 subscribers by the end of this year. Don't miss next week the spectacular style of Samuel from the Korean series Lucasum. To create the lighter areas, I will use bleach at 40 volumes to get the lift I needed. Observe on the picture the position of the color underneath the bangs, as you can see me doing here. And on the interior part of the long sides. If you are interested in doing this look, as always at the end of this video, I will share what face types will do well with this style. Do some horizontal segments on the sides at the crest area. These ones will show the tips, and more when you push it back. On the back area by the nape, I will bleach the tips to define the style, and add some dimension. Share with your friends the shorts on Instagram and TikTok, it's the best way to help this channel grow. I would really appreciate that. To tone the bleach areas, I will use a teal color. But this design can use other colors. Glide from 1821 is my favorite product to blow dry this type of hair. It's a phenomenal lotion after chemical processes. It heals your skin and it heals your hair. Try first the bangs using this technique to create a strong curtain bangs look going back. Thank you to Maria Sotelo for the design of Ciao on this mannequin head to make this video. Visit her new channel on YouTube. I will add a link on the description and one in the corner of this video. Here you see some examples of her work. They look familiar? Maria is a team member of the educational team. Thank you, Maria. At the end of the video, I will share which suggestion was the winner this week. Once the blow drying is done, I will work on the design of the front area. 
At this point, I haven't touched the long sections of the sides. I will cut the hair on the direction of the style, and I will be exposing some of the lighter pieces on the hair. If you like to see a similar style but on a real person, visit the video that I did on Baji. On that video, I used similar techniques and achieved similar look. Take your time to design the sides and the long pieces. These areas are a lot easier to cut on dry hair, when you can see the movement of the hair and where the lighter pieces are. In my opinion, this looks spectacular. What do you guys think? Use the texturizing shears on the direction of the look to facilitate the movement and direction on the ends. To detail the style, I will cocktail wax from 1821 with the oil. This product combination works great to separate the hair, adding shape to the style and shine. Depending on the picture that you see from Xiao, you will find long and short bangs. I choose to use this one. I feel like the longer bangs give you more play with the color. Mary did a great job on the face reproduction. Let's see if you can stay on level with the hairstyle. This style will look great on oval, hard, and diamond faces. As I mentioned before, you can use different combinations of color, like red with orange, or blue and purple. I hope you love this look, it was super fun to do. Here is the 360 view of Xiao's total look. This week the winning suggestion is trunks. This is Angel del Solar, the hairbender.